the sickness is mostly in the mind. Okay, take care that your mind is pure and simple and contented. Yeah, be grateful for whatever you have instead of wanting what you don't have. Then you always feel better and your physical body also becomes relaxed. And when it's relaxed, uh, the muscle and the body and the blood function well, and then you also feel healthy. Yeah? Mm. Don't pity yourself too much. Yeah. Okay? Everybody is sick sometimes or another. I get sick too. I was sick all this morning. I told you I keep running into the bathroom every two, three minutes. <laughs> I thought all the, the fluid in my body has been drained into the toilet. But I don't feel influenced by the sickness. I still come here. The reason I didn't come because I was busy running. <laughs> and I was thinking, uh, I, but I took care of myself. I took a lot of, I bring a lot of medicine for myself in my suitcase. Everything, uh, everything just for work and emergency, you know, like headache tablet, uh, diarrhea tablet, so, you know, whatever. And a lot of equipment for spiritual um, mission, as such as high heel shoes and. <laughs> no, actually not. Just one pair. Yeah, one pair to wear. That's it. This time I travel small, and now the high heels, uh, spiritual weapons, they bring it, <laughs> and I contact them and take it later. Anyway, I took some tablet. It didn't work. I took one more. It still did not work. I couldn't come here. I, I dress up already, and then I have to, to undress and then run again. And then I, th I thought it's okay. There's nothing else to go out, so I dress up again. And then I have to run again. Yeah, like many, many times. And normally, if you have diarrhea so long, you would have been very exhausted. But uh, I feel fine. I feel fine because uh, my concentration is on work. <laughs> I have work to do. <laughs> and then finally, I was fed up. I said, I had work to do. Okay, guys, just stop it. <laughs> <laughs> and then I came out here, and I still had very much trouble, but it's amazing how I can control the sickness even in that situation. And then when I came home, I have to throw all the clothes out and then run again immediately. The minute I left you, <laughs> go back to the, the sickness again. Yeah, but I did not feel bad at all. I just feel the sickness has nothing to do with me. Somehow like that. Just today, not every day. Like Sometimes if you have pounding headache, it's also very difficult to concentrate and do things. But today I, I had loose stomach and it was really un, 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 uncontrollable. <laughs> it's very unpleasant. You see, but if you're sick, you're sick, man. There's nothing wrong with that. Huh? Just the body that, that doesn't function one day, just like your car sometimes in trouble, yeah? Yeah, so you fix it. So it didn't work, the medicine. And I called the doctor up and he diagnosed something that I feel so scary, you know. I said, oh, forget it. <laughs> So I remember I have some home remedy. Yeah. So I go in the kitchen and cook something for myself. Yeah. Some toast and some concentrated soy and black pepper. Toast, yeah, when you burn it, you know, black or very, very brown or black, it has like carbon, it absorbs the poison, whatever in there. So, and then the soy, when you cook concentrated, it becomes thick paste. And you put some black pepper powder in it, and it warm up the stomach inside. Because when you have diarrhea, your stomach's cold. Yeah, and the the, the black pepper also has a disinfecting um, ability. Yeah, so I just eat the toast with that, and then I top it up with the congee, you know, rice rice soup, just white rice soup and water, and then immediately stop. So if you want to write that down, it's okay. Mm. Yeah, it really helped immediately. But sometimes when you're sick, you forget. You rely on outside medicine. I forgot, because I also brought some diarrhea medicine, you know, because when you travel around, sometimes you eat things that's not hygienic, yeah? So I always prepare everything for myself since I travel on I carry everything. But, but it didn't help. Normally I took one tablet, it helps immediately. Today it did not help at all. <laughs> so it has to be done. And then later, when I'm already so tired, I thought this is, has to stop. And then I cook something like that, and then I eat it, and it stopped immediately, and it's fine until now. Yeah, it's cool. Toast, burnt toast. 
and uh, concentrated soy sauce with black pepper. I put enough for you to, to, to just taste, you know, hot. That's it. Black pepper, huh? Black or white pepper powder is okay. Just uh, cook them together until they become thick like a paste, like a spread, you know? And then you spread it on toast or you just dip the toast in it and, and eat it. Stop immediately and you can drink also some ginger tea. Ginger powder, put it in water, stir and drink it. Uh, I was so thirsty, I even drink Coca-Cola too, but it was okay too. <laughs> yeah. So all this combination stop my, my illness immediately. Don't, don't, don't stay where the illness is, okay? Don't go there. Don't go to that miserable situation, places where your soul don't belong. Concentrate on the present. Concentrate on the blessing that you have. Concentrate on whatever at hand that is so nice and lovely. You see so many beautiful Buddhas here, and we have so many beautiful jokes and so many exciting new ideas. You concentrate on that. Don't stay home with your sickness and don't bring the whole home here. This is how your life becomes miserable. You concentrate always on the bad side and forget whatever goodness in front of you. You have so much, you don't know anything about what you have. I'm, I feel very sorry for you, not for your sickness, but for your stupidity, for your <laughs> whining quality, for, for your damaging thinking to yourself. Yeah? We have everything exactly what we need at exactly moments already. We chose to have. We chose to be in that way. So we are just perfect. I don't whine too much, you know, pity yourself too much. You make yourself a, a less than a human, less than a dignified person. And no wonder your life is, is no good and you have sickness all the time because that's all you have. <laughs> that's all you concentrate on. What you think so you become. Hmm? You let everything ride over your head and overwhelm your happiness and, and controlling your life instead of you take control of everything. That's how your life is miserable. And nobody can help you except yourself. You have to be fed up with this kind of mentality in order to get well. Yeah? <laughs>